Hey guys, this is John Wayne Doherty with JWD Lego Fun coming at you with a new video on this Raya and Sisu the Dragon set as well as an update on my modification of the Carrot House, made it a little bit bigger, and a couple of residents that I've put in there, and an update on my Disney Princess meet and greet that will include Raya. So make sure you like, share, and subscribe to my channel and all that will be up next. All right, we got so much to talk about. This new Raya and Sisu the Dragon set completes all of the Disney princesses that they have put out on market. Now, Elsa and Anna are technically not Disney princesses. They're part of Frozen, they're their own thing, but I have them included. Uh, in my meet and greet, which you'll see later. If you can go back to some of my other videos, you will see the Disney Princess meet and greet, and you can see that, and I'm gonna show you that as well later after I've incorporated Raya into that set today. So, uh, Raya and Sisu the Dragon set. This is set number 43184. Cute little set, definitely wanted it because I needed Raya for my meet and greet. And, you know, the dragon Sisu is very awesome. It's now out on Disney Plus without having to pay premium access for. So if you haven't checked it out, you have to check it out. It's great. And also make sure you watch the short called Us Again. It is incredible. Um, I'm also going to talk today about the modification that I made of this set, which is 40449. It was a gift with purchase that I did on my on the Winnie the Pooh video. I got this as a free gift with purchase. So I have in, expanded this set. And I'm going to show you that up close as well. And uh, so we will switch our camera view so that way we can get up close and personal with this set. All right, so we're going to start off with the little builds that are part of this Riot and the Last Dragon set. So we've got what is supposed to be like a little temple for the gem to be in and then this little waterfall with some more gems and things. Uh, Sisu is a water dragon if you have seen the movie. There's probably going to be spoilers in this so if you haven't seen the movie go watch the movie and then come back and watch this. But um, it's been out long enough now I don't feel guilty. So up here is this little hidden box and in the box is what's supposed to be the gem which is the dragon magic uh, concentrated into the little gem now in the movie it is not like this at all it's a it's like a hidden thing and uh Raya has to go through all this stuff to get into it to prove her worth to be a guardian of the gem which is what her father is uh and so uh a lot of times they interpret these sets in ways that i wouldn't necessarily say is exactly directly uh related to um the movie super super directly um especially with these princess sets so um you know, cute little builds. This one here has the little waterfall that goes up and you can go in and out of that. But, um, you know, obviously not super complicated. And uh, I will have to take parts of this set and use it in the Raya portion of my meet and greet. Next is Sisu the dragon herself. I said she's a water dragon. There are these foil, it's not paper, it's like foil, really thick foil type pieces that have been used uh, in here, which is something I have not seen before. Um, it might be in the, some other sets like elf sets or something, but this is something that I haven't seen before that I thought was neat. Um, her head is one piece. And last and certainly not least is Raya, and she has her sword, and she also has the map of the land in which she lives, and she's following the map because she's trying to get to the river's ends. There's like a hundred of them, and she's trying to find the one that has the 
dragon gem in order to uh, uh, she's trying to find the river's end in order to find Sisu, which obviously she does. So um, that's a different sword than I've seen before. Um, in the movie, that sword uh, can also come apart almost like a whip and then go back together. So it's super cool. Her uh, head is uh, her hair and her hat are all one piece together, which um, that's different than I've seen before as well. And uh, so I think that's a pretty cool piece to have. Um, like I said, and then there's this printed piece for her, uh, the map that's supposed to look like the dragon and the five different lands. All right, so I took this original carrot house and made it bigger. I used pieces of bulk that I got from the 1500 piece Lego uh, set that you can buy at Walmart. And uh, I used that to expand the set. So you see the front door is the same, the side windows, but I just used some extra orange and green pieces to try to expand it all. Um, the top is pretty much the same. Uh, inside, I added a bed, uh, there's the dresser, and all that was already there. If you, uh, I, the residents that I stuck in here are Bugs Bunny from Looney Tunes, uh, minifigure series, and then of course Rabbit from Winnie the Pooh, since Rabbit was with the Winnie the Pooh the set that, you know, this set came with as a gift with purchase. So, um, not super complicated, but just enough to you know, kind of make it a little bit more homey and a little bit more room. Uh, probably would display that next to my Winnie the Pooh set. And now I am going to show you the new updated Disney Princess Meet and Greet with Raya. All right, as I've shown you before, this is my Disney Princess Meet and Greet for my theme park. Lego has made 12 of the 13 Disney princesses, plus the two uh, Frozen, Elsa and Anna, which a total of 15. And uh, unfortunately, they have not made Pocahontas. So as I said in my video before, I've got a spot for Pocahontas right there, but I do not, uh, ha there's not a Lego set for her. So that's something that I will be looking to try to find something or a, a, a doll, a mini doll or a mini figure that would work in that spot. So there's everybody as you go around in case you hadn't seen it before. That way you can look at it. I've got Elsa and Anna in the middle here. And then I also have added Raya to the middle. I left a space for her because I knew there was going to be a set coming out for her. So I took that main set there and then that'll be her meet and greet. Um, so, um, you, there she is. You can't see her face because of her hat from this angle. But, uh, what we will do is I will be able to put mini figures along my sidewalk here and have them be able to take pictures with the princesses and things like that. Just like you do at the Disney park. So Raya has her home now. Uh, just like everybody else. So I have that at least all complete and uh, super happy about that. So if you get a word on a Pocahontas set coming out or a way to make a Pocahontas for this set, please let me know in the comments. Uh, also let me know again, which one is your favorite Disney princess. Love the Riot and the Last Dragon movie. I thought it was absolutely great. And we will... Um, keep doing updates to this as we go along if we get some more princesses I just want to say thanks to everybody for watching and uh, I hope you enjoyed this little update with all of with the Raya and the Last Dragon uh, set Raya, uh, Raya and Sisu and Raya's addition to the princess meet and greet and the expansion of the carrot house. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. I'm usually pretty quick about getting back to everybody. And remember also to like and subscribe 
and share my channel with other people you think love Lego and love Disney. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.